Hello everyone, Messy Plays here, back at it again. How are you doing today? I am playing Life is Strange Before the Storm Episode 3. Uh, Revenge of the Salad Bowl. Rachel just smashed a table in the last episode. That was the huge cliffhanger we were left on. But are you sure that Chloe should be here for... Chloe stays. Oh, God. Of course. Come on then. In every way that matters, Rose is my wife and your mother. But the woman you saw at the Overlook, her name is Sarah. Okay. Your birth mother. Your vagina mother. Oh shit. They're not doing this crap again, are they? This is in the fit. What? Why has he turned into a pair of binoculars? did you from for so long? But the truth can be hard to look at. Is this really something you're ready for? Maybe. I don't know. What is with the story? It's completely undramatic and uninteresting to me. Sorry. I know it's a downer to start the episode like this. Just completely... Like, this is the last episode. And the kind of cliffhanger ending oh. of the last one was... Oh, this woman that you saw in the park, it's your mother. I don't even know this character. I'm here. I'm right here. Good. Now, in the first game, you. Life is Strange, um, I can't remember what her name. Max she has this extended dream sequence that just went on for like two hours. Pointed viewfinder, hold down and press S to join Rachel. The problem with the games being episodic is that you keep playing it, but you forget the controls. So each each episode gives you a tutorial on the controls. Because it's like, well, you play for two hours and then you you miss it for two months. Oh, shit. When I was in high school, there was one person everyone adored. Her teachers, her friends. Sarah was everyone's favorite. Every boy wanted to date her. What's with the screen, Taryn? I could barely believe it when she picked me. Oh. Sometimes. Bless them. I think that's what kept Look at that style. For so long. They didn't have tight pants like that in the 80s. Well, you know what I mean. You know, tight, well-fitting jeans? No, they didn't. She was so alive. They don't even make an effort so to make this look like the fucking past. Everything. Uh, yeah. It's Early like on, John Travolta. I realized I wasn't enough for her. All right. This right in his look at this animation. While the rest of us were pursuing college, careers, families. She was looking for Sarah booze. Sarah wasn't looking for any of that. She was looking. For Let me escape. guess, Sarah had powers as well can we just skip to the last one sarah has ice powers when sarah became pregnant i thought it would solve everything is he a doctor and it did for a little while or was he just you know dressed like that as the father father it's the greatest moment of my life so much love but the other two episodes didn't screen turn this one screen Taryn oh my god what's going on however much she loved you then it wasn't enough needles for Sarah the she's a heroin addict was always there that's a trusting Ronnie mascara For over a year, I tried to help her. Oh, I shit. I made myself believe that she was still a good person. That no matter what happened, she would never do anything to hurt you.
Rock and roll. What's wrong? Eventually, I saw her for who she really was. A destructive person. Um. Someone who could never be satisfied. Train spotting. The American version. Anyone or anything. Even the love of her own daughter. I was desperate. I didn't know what to do. So I made a choice. I was never going to let her harm you again. Okay. Why does this matter? No offense, but... I don't know. This story is just... These three episodes have been about nothing, to be fair. What you saw at the Overlook? She looks good. good. It was true. You kissed. He's an excellent liar. Oh, this is what he's telling his wife. Yeah, it was true. You saw me. And I was happy for her. I was, you know, and she felt like she embracing her together. But I was so empty inside. But she didn't get just that boner. It was just an automatic reflex. Not after what she'd done. Interesting sleeve. But after all the people she hurt. I mean, if she's trying the to be. She destroyed. I told her she'd been given the greatest gift in the world the chance to be your mother. I mean, she looks like she's cleaned herself up. So. And she squandered it. Yes. Yeah, but she made a mistake. She, the kid was it a baby. Pained me. Her like can you that. can you not? But I'd do it again. Can you not and like again and again? Re you know you reevaluate see. your decision. You know if she's like fifteen, eighteen, however old she is in this game. Can you not say maybe it's possible that she's on the straight and narrow now? Okay. So that was the first time you've seen her or spoken with her in 15 years? No. I send her money. Every single month. It's... Alimony. Arrangement. Got the Brendan Fraser arrangement. But now she wants to see me? And that female from, yes. um... Is it V? It cannot be. Why not? Who says it's your decision? Yeah, who says it's your decision? Do you think you have the right to decide that? Oh, Chloe, her? can't stay when out I of it. Sarah, when I took Rachel away, I truly believe I saved her life. And I will continue to protect yes. her Yes. No matter what. Fifteen years ago, you saved Maybe her life. she's different now. I mean, people change, right? If she's cleaned up. So, but consider that for fifteen years... She's preferred that money to you. Mm. Rachel. I think I need to lie down. Is that the necklace from Moana? Moana? Moana. His big club thing. I don't know. This story... I don't feel like there's an actual point to the story in this game. This spin-off one has felt very random. I I can't leave Rachel to deal with this alone. All right, well then let's just go upstairs. Hold on. I've turned the detail down, but it looks like the um, the screen tear is still there. So the, is that like an opt on optimization thing? I mean, it's not actually my computer. It's how the game is designed. Because the other episodes have run fine, but this one's got screen tearing all over it. I think they probably rushed this one. I mean, it was in the cutscenes. I just haven't felt an attachment to these characters again. It hasn't happened. Um... 
this is the last episode, I believe, and I just, like, no offense, couldn't care less about Rachel. You know, her character is so uninteresting to me. Chloe is Chloe. She got most of her devel development from the first game. Uh, Rachel? Yes. Is that like a kind of... Hell is empty. Okay. Oh, you I gotta... need some way to show Rachel that I'm here for her. Really? Is that what we're doing now? What is an enneagram? Is there a section on how to walk fours through batshit crazy family drama? No? Um, at the end of the last episode, they agreed to run away. And I thought, wow. Do it. Let's do it. Let's take this somewhere I don't expect. Like, let's depressurize this cabin. I want to know what's like, you know. I could get grades like this. I just don't want to. Indefeasible of mind and spirit. An absolute indefeasible. I've never heard of that. Um flowers save the flowers a rose <laughs> at least she'll have something from tonight um even you Willie couldn't come up with the tragedy Rachel's going through The complete works of Billy Shakespeare. You can't beat a bit of the bard. Let's get her a card. Rachel's surrounded by so much love. Yet she seems so... Disconnected. Uh, alone. You know why? Because she's a fucking teenager. This light needs more light. Okay. Um, turn the lights off and then. Wonder what I could find around here to brighten up that nightlight. Rachel even knows how to make a dinky lamp look cool. Um, a flashlight maybe? Is this how we're doing it? Alright, take the top off this other light, I guess. Okay, LED torch. This is going to have to somehow screw on, I guess. What? Come on. Come on. You're a genius, Chloe. All right, let's oh, go and just shine Rachel's that in the show. fucking face. Better get her attention first. Rachel, you like my new chain? You like my new chainsaw and hockey mask? Let's sing to her. I actually had one of them machines. Hey. A laser kind of star projector. Very effective, trust me. It's beautiful. Beautiful. I thought you might like it. I mean, you own this thing. I've always loved stars. Hmm. Why? You remind us there's so much beauty out there, which we almost never see. I mean, because we're blinded. By what's in front of us. Mm. <laughs> exactly. But then I learned the truth. Oh, the stars fuck we're me. Seeing have 
already been dead for millions of years. And the light is just reaching us. They're all the photographs what? of the past. I think you're being a bit emo-ish now. Um, still beautiful. But that doesn't make them any less beautiful. I don't right? think. I mean, I don't know. Who knows? If they're not even real, then what's the point? I don't think that's true. It's all lies. I know it takes Everything. millions of years for the light to reach us, My but entire life. it doesn't mean they're actually dead. My dad. <laughs> My mom. I mean, it's a big thing. It's sh shell shocking, you know, big thing, but. And that other woman. My real mom. She's the biggest part <sighs> of all. I can't trust any of them. You can trust me. The only one in the world I can trust. Okay. You see, why is that maybe going? Because if that was a joke, I would go with it. But then she, maybe she's like, T take offense. Oh. I'll take it. Even if it's only by process of elimination. <laughs> Thank you. Good. Are they gonna kiss? Oh, they kissed last time. I wore this bracelet my entire life. I never even asked why. Never even thought about it. <laughs> Somehow, I think I always knew. That you just didn't even look I like didn't your mother. Know that my real mother was gone. Space to leave the bed. I'll give her like three seconds. One, two. All right, let's leave. The fact that she's here right now, that she came here for me. I think I need to see her. Is that wrong? How can it be wrong? No, it's not. How, by what definition would that be wrong? But if she's actively trying to meet you. It would be tough to track her down. How? Yeah. Just get on Facebook. That's true. Luckily, I've got my secret weapon. Facebook. Chloe. But what if we can't find her? <laughs> like I can ask my dad I have no idea where to start well we know a drug dealer don't we I got an idea I think I know what to do I'll call Frank and get him to connect us to her you do that you do that for me shot. of course even if we know where she is we need a way to get to her. I can't just ask my parents for a ride. Oh my god. Don't worry. I've got that one covered too. Okay. You do? Yeah. And I. In fact. And for a third thing, I need like. Could come up with. Ten bucks. I'll handle it. Alright. I know you will. I need about. 20 bucks. Even if we find her, how will I talk to her? What do I say? Maybe with an accent. Um, it doesn't matter. After my dad died, I didn't know how to keep talking to him. I still don't. But it doesn't matter. I forgot about that. All that matters. I forgot that her dad's dead there. in this. And she hasn't went off the rails yet. This, Your dad? This, these episodes have been so confusing. In my dreams. He's there. And it's so real. 
It's almost like it's another part of my life. It used to be the only part that mattered. I've never told anyone about that. Yeah, it was kind of lame. Uh, Rachel? Just I was tonic. just thinking... Maybe I was wrong Oh before. my god. <laughs> Who cares if the stars are dead? Okay. As long as we can still see them, that means they're real. To us. Right? Right. Okay. I mean, it was a nice scene, but... I don't know. Stars are real, guys. The stars are real. Even if they're dead, they're real. No, not a dream sequence, please. Not a dad, not this raven shit. Fuck me, man. This stuff is kind of try hard. They're trying too hard. It's even like... I don't know. We can't even get 20 minutes into this episode without one of these. Hey, maybe you should let me try. You always do it wrong. That was one time. When are you going to let it go? She Remember there's that raven to work on cars together. Those are some of my favorite memories. Okay, my dad is alternating between our stepdad. Your memories or my memories? Don't you mean my memories? I don't think you remember after you're dead. You she got a beard. That looked like she had a beard. Why don't you go take a look? You sure? This is stupid. This is just stupid. You should like lean over and wind the window down to talk to her. Okay. Uh, what's wrong? Don't you see anything? I'll play along. It's, it's a spark plug. Go and look for no, one. That's not it. I just had that replaced. Isn't improv supposed to be all about yes and? Yes and what? Exactly. Dad, stop. N none of this is real. You're not real. Ra Rachel's family isn't real. This whole thing, it, it's, it's all just theater. Pantomime. Well, you know what William Shakespeare said. I'm dead. Sound and fury. Something about stories told by idiots, full of sound and fury, signifying fuck all? Nailed it. But I don't want to be an actor. Is that like a floating stage I just light? To be myself. You know that scene in Simpsons where the parody like. Twin Peaks with like hmm. Well that Maybe guy dancing a with a pretend. unicorn with a traffic light behind him. Maybe the lies this is what this feels like less horrible when you don't have like a really intriguing wow. story. You can't That's get away with these dream sequences. Because it just feels like, it, this what feels like filler to me. From? It feels like pattern. There's my cue. Chloe's yeah. quite well together in this. Relax, sweetie. It doesn't, she doesn't strike it's me as needing these kind of right? 
really right. deeply just a contemplative a magic. meditations. Bloodlight. I would understand if it was the, the Chloe effects. from the original games, like Chloe. if she was already there. Look at me. And she was having this kind of Look troubling, me, rebellious period, it's and this was. Okay. And this is what she was thinking. What's up with your eyebrows? Okay. Well, now we're in the inception. Right. That was. They had already nailed it because it was it was miming. It was pantomime. Why didn't he just get run over by an invisible truck? That was hilarious. I don't know. Oh my god. I already complained before the game started about the dream sequences and they just already stuck one in and it was a big fat kind of disappointment to me. It's just not working. It's not coming together. Chloe the person in the game doesn't feel like the Chloe that's having these thoughts she's not there I would understand if she was the rebellious Chloe is she starting to get there? has she dyed her hair yet? she's smoking you know doing whatever she's not doing any of that I saw Sarah leaving Frank's RV he might know how to find her he might also be totally pissed about Damon's money. I've got to get this exactly right. I can do this. Price. Oh, Frank. Eager much? Where's the money? I know, I swear, 25 minutes in, we haven't had a single scene where we can walk around. There's, there's been no gameplay in all recycled kind of locations in this. Isn't that really, really suspicious? I have a question to ask you first. Even for a kind of conversation simulator, this is pushing it. I need to find that woman from yesterday. Sarah. Frank? What the hell for? Something important can you help hmm I would really appreciate it I'm your favorite client remember she's not even holding the fucking phone our fingers are going through the phone man Sweet. thanks man you're a real piece of work that went well I guess. What am I getting myself into? Oh, God. Okay. I've got two hours to kill. A shower would be fucking amazing. Step that's going to be in the show. Mom playing music? Hmm. Is that David's towel? Where the hell is mine? Okay. My towel. No awesome pirate towel. Lots of washcloths. No towel. Is this what we've come to? What is up with the graphics? That isn't like a performance thing. That's that's an optimization thing. This game just doesn't run well. What's this receipt for? No way. Mom actually sold her ring? For three hundred dollars. Shit. David really is moving in. Can we find this towel? Can we find this epic adventure to find this towel?
Wow, this game looks crap. They really shit up the engine if this is what it runs like now. What the fuck? I really hate that mom keeps hiding this photo. I don't know, man. You gotta let the past go. Okay guys, I'm gonna have to leave it there. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. And catch me next time for some more Life is Strange Before the Storm. Goodbye guys.